students of Sandeep Foundation Information Technology Department are here to present our project Offender Identification at Traffic Signals Using Image Processing. Nowadays, accidents are rampant in the world and not following signals are major cause of it. Like if you google statistics over the accidents, more than 5000 people died at the traffic signals. Accidents can be avoided by various ways but there is no way to ensure that people follow the traffic rules. In our project, we are going to ensure that we are going to create an environment that people follow the traffic rules. Our pro in our project, we are going to use laser technology and image processing for capturing the vehicle and vehicle number easily. Me and my friend Aishwarya will be explaining about the flow of the diagram. As explained by Snehal before, the traffic rules and signals are not followed if the traffic police are absent. So, the Aish Aishwarya will be explaining about the flow of our diagram. These are the lasers situated at the intervals of the road. The lasers are connected to the Arduino. Various sensors are also connected to the Arduino. The role of the Arduino is to on off the laser. Arduino will be the head of the architecture. Whenever a vehicle comes into a signal, if the signal signal is red, the lasers are on. If the signal is green, the lasers are off. If an offender disturbs the laser, the cameras get switched on and the number plate of the offender gets scanned. As the camera captures the vehicle number, the data is sent to the Arduino and various sensors connected to, to the Arduino store the data onto it. The cameras are connected to the system. The database of the offender is sent to the RTO. The role of the RTO is to generate fine to the offender. Whenever the data is collected by the Arduino, the image is processed and it, uh, the processed image is sent to RTO by which the RTO can get to know about the offender's name, address and other details by which he can be fined. Hi, I'll be elaborating on the technologies that we have used in this project. First and foremost, I would like to tell you about OCR, that is Optical Character Recognition. The use of OCR has been made in this project for the identification of the number from the number plate of the offender. Along with this, we have used an Arduino. The Arduino is, as my friends told you, the brain of behind this project. With that, we have used some sensors for the identification of these offenders. These are some of the technologies that we have used in this project. So, to sum it up with, I would like to add that our project aims at creating an environment which discourages people to break traffic rules and creates a safer road for commoners like you and me. Thank you.